recording. Recording has been started. Right. Okay. Who wants to do a recap without using the words Blorvius from my games? Um, I could do one, I think. Yeah, sure. Um, in my notes, I have that we left the circus to go to the underground path. Um, we broke into the curiosity shop and went down into the underground tunnel. Um, after we had, like, caught everybody up on things, um, Skylar and such had a little bit of a discussion there. We ate second dinner. No. <laughs> Um, we did eat second dinner, yes, because the DM <laughs> forgot that you ate first dinner. It's fine. Um, we almost immediately fucked up on the stealth roll when we got down in the, the tunnel bit and then alerted the guard, the, the fucking rogue people. Couldn't hit us for shit. Um, they could a little bit, but not not much. Um, we we kind of destroyed them a lot. Uh, and eventually got into one of the big rooms with Blorvius. Or whatever the fuck. I'm, was it was it Borvius or was it His name is Borvius. Borvius? Oh, I'm sorry. I actually didn't know that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I forgive you for this single transgression. <laughs> Should the word Borvius pass, pass your lips again, I'm ending you. I'm so sorry. But anyways, well, yes. um the we we knocked him the fuck out with soot um kind of peace bunning him and then it was what was it? Um Victor or was it Victor who who beat that man's ass? I can't remember. Uh Cal and I Cal and together, yeah. if I recall correctly. Yeah. 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 They they Thank just uh, destroyed Tyler him. Also got ahead of yeah, because there was three opportunity him. attacks that were provoked because of peace bonding. Uh, because that of man. peace bond. Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and Aya was the one who tipped it over into non-lethal because I think the others were just going for lethal. Uh, Cal did yeah. lethal damage because they don't do non-lethal damage. Yeah. Um, yeah, just Tyler did non-lethal. Yeah. yeah. We accidentally oh, killed yeah. one also, of the rogues, it seems like. But that was Cal's <laughs> fault. <laughs> There was, yeah, I was going to say, there was that time Cal did 16 damage to a, a 10 hit point man and then realized later that they actually were supposed to have done 21 damage to a 10 hit point man. <laughs> Fucking overkill. Um, we found one of the merchants, or was there, I think there was more than one person down there in the, the kind of jail bit of the two. tunnel. There was two. Being held captive. Yeah, and they were there part were of like a merchant. Yeah, there. there was two merchants down there. Um, we ended up finding... Um, uh, the the information on, like, where the attacks had happened in that, like, conference room, quote-unquote, thing that they had down there that they had rushed out of, apparently, maybe because of us? Who knows? Um, Definitely because yeah, of us. Because yeah. the alarm was raised that there were intruders in their yeah. evil lair. <laughs> yep. Um, <laughs> that the, the, the skulk had kind of, like, evaded us a bit, ran off up out of the sewer bit, um, to go talk with the, the, we know now, uh, guilty lady, I guess, the one who runs the shop, we obviously think that she's in with this stuff, she just really, like, was good at disguising that, apparently. Um. Yep. And, what else? We got, Fern got keys from the Skulk, um, and gave them gold for that. Um, what was the keys for, though? I can't remember. Cell. The, the oh, the cell, cells. that's what it was. Right, right. I couldn't remember what my my stupid session notes meant. <laughs> um, what was, okay. was there anything else? I don't think so. We ended up getting out of there, I think, though, because we were gonna... Or at least no, trying I think, to. Uh, I think we delayed on getting out of that because we were, um... Oh yeah, we need to find where, Yeah. And where the other skull, the one who actually murdered the gods, was, and they are apparently with um I can't remember her name Wife. right now. Yeah. Mrs. Mrs. Borvius. Yeah. <laughs> Mistress Rebella Moncello. Yeah. Rebella, I thought it was Rebella, but I wasn't certain. Rebella um, Rebella Moncello, yes. Sorry, every Which time I hear that, I think leaving of Rebella, me, like, her disease. Think that she's gonna be the next model. Yeah. 
And they call it a haunch. Yeah, there was mm. a, there was several places that were like circled with interest, like they were planning on going there and killing people. Also, so. I would also like to point out, just to remind you, everyone, uh, Victor is wearing a different face right now. Yeah, they were a red <laughs> tiefling, right? Red, or red blue. dyke. Right? Yeah, red, yeah. Red um, dyke, yeah. Red leather jacket dyke. Yeah. Leather jacket dyke. She's changed her gender slightly, but still <laughs> very much in that brand. Mm-hmm. Just a it's still spectrum. very much gender. There's still gender. Good. Cal also uh, went and searched all the people that they didn't, and did kill, uh, and stole all their shit. Yeah. You did do that, yeah. Did you write down all the shit that I told you was there? Yep. Okay, good. Because I did not. Um, <laughs> I think that's so, it, right? That, that sounds about right. Um, we yeah. We checked um, all but one of the rooms. Yes. Oh, yeah, that we had that um, one last room to look at, but we were... It was late. It was late, and also, out of character, I'm not sure if any of you can mechanically even open this door. Take um, it down. Well... <laughs> <laughs> Trapped. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. So, let's, you guys let's are Let's not all... spend half an hour on a door. <laughs> if if you guys can make an attempt on it, but I'm not... I will tell you right now, this might... I don't think anybody has disabled device. I don't think so either. And... And this is a skill. This is a door that I'm not gonna let you um, at like do disabled device untrained because it's a vault door, and none of you have experience Fair. picking that kind of lock. I mean, yeah. but theoretically, they would have had like a key or something to it. We're because just, we're gonna I... leave the door. There, yes, there is a key to it. So I'm telling you right now. That if you sit around looking for the key in the room with the door in it, that's not where you're going to find a way into the door. But as you guys are all sort of, um, it's Aya and Skylar who are in um, the room that has the door. Um, it's Skylar will take a look at it because I'm going to utilize my DM privilege here and the fact that Jamie is not present. Skylar's going to take a look at it and conclude reluctantly that the lock is beyond their skill to pick. Someone could try to force it, but they're not sure. It looks very sturdy and reinforced, like they have some very valuable stuff back there. Um, Skylar would relay this information to Aya. Everybody else is sort of out in the hallway. It's tempting, but Sid is thinking that it's probably stolen shit or whatever, and he's not about that. <laughs> what? Stolen shit? Why would there be stolen shit? They're criminals, PK! <laughs> Why would there be stolen shit in this, in this criminal enterprise's headquarters? What? What? I'm sure. I'm sure the sheriff's office can employ a, bla a locksmith to get that open at their discretion. Yeah, I think. I'm fine with just getting a reward for what we've done already. Don't really I'm care about what's in I'm not interested in there. carrying hot. I'm not interested in carrying hot goods, though. So I will pass as well. Thank you. Not worth the time. Uh, Cal, who's carrying a whole set of armor and a sword, it's like, yeah, I'm good. I already got my <laughs> shit. Listen, he he, they won that in battle. That's theirs. <laughs> you also had told the uh, the two dwarven merchants to wait while you searched. Um, mm -hmm. And you do know that the skulk had escaped up a ladder at yeah. the edge of the hallway. Victor is still running numbers if she wants to follow. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, I want to go up the ladder. Okay. I, I'm going to go up to the ladder and, like, make a motion like I'm about to start climbing. And then, like, look at everyone else <laughs> for it's... approval. Or, like, a nod yeah. or a, a just acknowledgement. So just, like, slings his staff back on his back and uh, rolls up his sleeves and will follow after you. <laughs> Here we go. Alright, if y'all are going, Victor will follow as well. Okay. Yep. Kyle will follow as well. Okay. Yep, so what, still... Should we maybe get the Vic... merchant people out of here? Or are we just uh, leaving Victor them down still here? Red. Um. Uh, so it is right. Do we want to get the merchants now, or do we want to wait until we're willing to co to collect the watch? I would rather leave them down here for a little bit. Do the last of the cleanup. Uh, Victor will pop her head quickly, pop her head into that room, and just be like. We're going to be a minute. There's another section upstairs we want to check. Can you just keep keep tight? Uh, yes, sir. Just, um... What would you like us to do if, if all the... He points to the pile of, like, tied-up unconscious people that you guys have in front of them in this room. Like, what would you like us to do if they, uh, uh, start stirring? Get them tied up. Hit him in All the right head. Then. Knock him out again. All right then. Uh, don't be too too vicious though. Uh, well, we're good sheriff. Such so a shrugs. <laughs> the, the guy you're talking to kind of looks like well, too vicious is relative. Yeah. <laughs> Victor gives him a look. He just sort of he just sort of nods, puts his hands behind his back, just. Sort of leaning up against the wall. <laughs> chilling. He's just chilling. Yeah. Right. Alright. Uh, I will be right back. Okay. What We're going is... up the ladder, I guess. What is the ladder climbing order? Uh, burn. Burn first, I guess. Mm-hmm. Uh, I mean, Sid had been the one to follow immediately after, so I guess him. Yikes. <laughs> Uh, I figure Aya will take up the bat because she's kind of got a because she's got a pretty good pair of eyes. So can okay. uh, Victor will be after Sud. Okay. Maybe we should make a line of that. There you go. Sorry. No, you're good. Don't worry about it. I'm gonna I'm gonna just call it as I see it then, since yeah. Then Aya. Okay. So, give me a second to fuck with the map. There's beans in the swiped right channel, by the way. Oh my god, I saw beans. him. In my boy is also there. Beans. Oh my god. Beans. There's boys. There's men in there. Holy fuck. Imagine. Imagine. Babe, Jamie sent me the post that, like, the post about, you know, the men's tits that you, whatever, that you were blogged yeah. recently. I just, I yeah. love that Jamie's like, ah, yes. Uh, Jamie sent that, that post about tits. <laughs> Jamie sent that post to us and then said, lol, whoops, I sent you your own post. I love God. that the first thought in her head when she sees men's tits is to send it to us. God bless. Ah, <laughs> oh, you like men. Men, what can I say? Tits. Yeah, you what like men. Say? You'll understand this one. <laughs> yeah. Men do her. have tits. Um, they important. Do. <laughs> PSA, uh, men have tits. <laughs> <laughs> important fucking announcement, everybody. <laughs> everybody, everybody, Every roll a knowledge local check about the men's tit. <laughs> oh, gladly. Yeah, I, <laughs> I think I have proficiency Victor, in that. Victor oh, will, that's not much. Victor will take disadvantage. 
<laughs> I know disadvantage doesn't exist. I'm taking it anyway. <laughs> Take disadvantage on men's tits. I got an 11. You may, however, have... <laughs> well, that that makes I that should makes not sense. say that. I should not say that. That makes sense. Anyway, <laughs> it does. I mean, yeah. All right, where's... Hold on. I'm... I have to put my knowledge local in correctly because it's not <laughs> correct. Are you? And you don't need to. <laughs> we have no, to. No, I'm rolling it. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> God. Oh my God. Men's tits. Men's tits. <laughs> you don't know anything about. No, actually, you know why that's so fucking funny. Why? Remember what Fern I was... used. What? You remember what Fern used to do? <laughs> I can't believe you bombed your men's tits check, dude. <laughs> you know why? I know why. Anyway, <laughs> so far you climb the ladder. Everybody else is yeah. still over in the alleyway on this map because I'm not moving you yet. But Fern, Fern, you are where you are. Can you see where you are in this area? Yes. Okay, yes. Bob. Can I can I look around? Yes. Make before a perception I fully... check. I'm gonna look around before I go all the way out of the ladder. Okay, you're just poking your head up. Like a gopher. Nineteen. 19. Okay, hold on one second. There's a skulk up here. I'm not looking here. at a stat block or anything. There's a skulk up here. I sense it in my bones. <laughs> Fern doesn't, though. Fern doesn't Fern know does, shit. I do. Fern does not necessarily sense a skulk. Uh, if I can find the fucking stat block that I'm definitely not looking for, though, that'd be great. I can't hit control F on my keyboard, so I can't- I have to scroll. No. <laughs> Which is a huge L. L. Another huge L is the fact that I ordered coffee and they gave me the wrong stuff. No! No! That's horrible, I'm sorry. It's- it's a devastating blow. I'll, I'll tell you that straight out. Some reason my mind auto filled that too. It's a devastating blow for the men's tits community. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I mean, it that, is that. the role Nocturne made is a devastating blow for the men's tits community. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> what did you say you rolled? Nineteen. Ni Nineteen. Okay. You do not see anything. You do not see any movement, that is. You see boxes around you. There is uh, this little dotted line that goes across the floor is indicating that there's a catwalk up above you. This is a big warehouse with a lot of boxes. It's a shipping and handling facility. Um, Amazon. It, it is, unfortunately, it is an Amazon warehouse now, I guess. Um, but you do not see anything m alive or moving or anything like that. Alive or moving. Or moving. You know, just because undead things move too. I want it to be inclusive. Mm -hmm. uh, Love that. I will out. So yeah. poke his head up. Okay. Do I get shot immediately? <laughs> no, not immediately. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, so eventually. <laughs> we have a time. Who's to, who's to say? <sighs> you. You's to say. I am, yeah, I am to say. Oh, God, you! Oh, right. Okay. I'm God. <laughs> oh no, the complex. <laughs> wait, wait, 19. I did my math wrong. You do notice something. Ah. Uh -huh. I I'm sorry, I can't do numbers right now. It's That's God is bad at math. You don't notice it at first, but there is a tiny shift from where you are standing. You see a tiny shift of movement on the other side 
of this stack of crates, which is tall enough to conceal a human-sized person, but is um, there's a gap here that you just sort of see a flash of movement. Okay. Oh, then go up there. Um, I will crawl up like I haven't seen anything. I'm going to okay. turn around. I'm going to press... Like, as soon as I'm out, I'm going to press a finger to my lips, looking down at so that... He'll, he'll be quiet. But I'm going to take... Just take a step to the side and give her a set. Not... Right. I'm not gonna... Tr I'm gonna try and not change angle to where I could see behind that, because I want this person to think I haven't seen them. Okay. Or, and I'm going to... I'm, would I see a flash if they moved from that spot? You, what you, the flash that you saw, um, was probably them moving from this spot to a spot, let, I'm not sure if I'm on the right layer. There we go. From this spot to somewhere further behind the boxes, like you saw them moving in a that way direction. But if... But if but they couldn't like get to another thing of box. Could they get to another thing of boxes without me they, seeing? They couldn't get to like that box, for instance. Okay. No. Okay. They probably can only stick unless they are. If they are a skulk, then who's to say? If they yeah. are not a skulk, they probably can't. Because yeah, we gave enough time for that the skulk we let go to like get out, right? As far as you know, like, they would have had plenty of time to yeet their yeah. whole self. Um, okay. So... So, okay, so Sid, is Sid climbing out? Yeah, he would have climbed out, um, trying to be stealthy about it as much as you can be for fucking coming out of a hole. Uh... <laughs> Alright. Yeah, Fern's not trying to be unnoticed, they're just trying to be quiet. Yeah. But so, I don't know if that matters for stealth rolls. Yeah. If you want to make a stealth roll to see how quiet you are, go ahead and anybody can mm. do that. See, I don't want to roll bad on it. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's fair. I, you can, you, Fern, can probably assume that someone at least knows you are here. Uh, yeah, I'm also so, in full armor, so I will mm -hmm. be loud no matter what. Yeah. Ooh. I'm so not did... trying to be unseen, I guess. Um, yeah. Soot did roll stealth. Uh, unnatural 20 for Soot. Okay. When Victor comes up the ladder, she will also be doing it for a 12. Um, Sid will yeah. probably back away and do the same motion that, um, Fern had done to Victor, and back up, giving them room. Everyone's just like, climb out the ladder, turn and shush, climb out the ladder, turn and shush. Yep. All Pretty right. much. Victor, you can yeah. easily, easily, uh, uh, make your way up and out. I'm gonna move a little this way. Okay. Um, Cal is I'm, next in the order if you of the lot climb, but uh, Fern was up. Uh, I'm going to. Hmm. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out how to word this. Gesture for someone, for for someone to stand like about right where for like right here ish. Um. So that way, if they run around this way, there's a person there. Because Fern's going to slowly walk around this way and try and get them. Oh, there's, there's a ladder there, too. Hmm. Trying to All right, so around. you're motioning for someone to stand in this space? Yeah. There will. Victor is very much watching you, like, what what's, what are we doing? What's the play? Hello? Fern, 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 like, points at the boxes, like, gesturing 
Fern pantomimes, there's a person on the other side of the boxes. Um, or like, there's something. Yeah. Okay, Victor will I not. heard something. Victor, Victor will be ready to intercept as necessary. <laughs> I'll pass scurvy on a motherfucker again, I'll do it. <laughs> Don't test me now. Y'all. Sut's right. gonna that haul some... his ass over here and hide, like, right there. Is someone else coming up? Uh, uh yeah, yes, Cal, come Cal up. Next. Cal is coming up. Cal is not gonna roll stealth because Cal is, like, attached the armor, um, in some dubious manner, um, and just not even gonna try. <laughs> <laughs> like they're 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 being careful and quiet, but they're they're not trying for stealth. And this is the armor you took off of um, Borbius. That is indeed. Okay, good to know. <gasps> oh no. <sighs> um. <laughs> so. Can I also head up at this point? Or oh. yeah. At this point, yeah. as you guys are maneuvering, we can say that you all get up the ladder and you can position yourselves within reason near the trap door. Yeah. Aaron's gonna Victor take another step. Is stealth? Yeah, go ahead and roll stealth. Not 20 for 23. Put it in the chat, please. Um, Fern was about to do something? Oh, Fern just takes another step that way. As, as Fern is... Go for it. Sorry, as Fern is sort of doing that, Victor's gonna try to get Cal's attention and get them to go kind of like here-ish as also like catch them if they run that way. Cal will oblige. Thank you. So it's gonna mirror a little bit of what um, Fern is doing. So he's kind of like following them or him step from step, so... Okay, and I'll say Skylar is also making their way up the ladder at this point. Perhaps it's the cat box that we can possibly spot. Oh uh, yeah, so there's... wait, say again? Is there access to the catwalks yeah, from this ground a ladder, a ladder here to get up to the catwalk. Um, can you ping me? Uh, it's it's right check. here, right? Okay. Oh, okay. It's a perception check. Yeah, just a fresh one, just for fun. Not 20. Oh, or 26. Yes. <laughs> okay, yes. let me... Nice, nice. Let me check something. That was okay. good. Finally. So, I'll tell you what you do notice. Mm -hmm. You notice... This is not going to look right, because I don't have the catwalk map set up, so I didn't feel like dealing with the catwalk, because it was confusing. So, I'm putting somebody on the map, they are on the catwalk. Ah. Uh. You see here a skulk. Okay. I was about to ask what your armor class was, but she just rolled a natural one. Um, because <laughs> what you did not see was the woman oh. directly in front of you. Oh, shit. Um, whose invisibility just kicked off when she tried to attack you. Um, a woman with a strange, almost, she looks human ish. She has strange, exaggerated features right now. There's something unnatural about it. There is fangs in her mouth and claws on her fingers and her body looks almost feline in the way it is arranged and she's holding a small vial in one hand and she just tried to swipe at you with the other um and now she is no longer um no longer stealth but she was going to make her second attack um ah. what's your armor class uh, eight, 18? Fuck! Ah. 
I missed it by one point. Oh no! God damn it! Rip. Um, everybody roll initiative. Okay. Ah, oh, give me, yes. give me good. If you don't give me good initiative, I swear to God, let me. Please. I rolled a natural. Come uh, on, roll good. Okay, oh, that's have... not good Victor. for Soot. Um, what's his thing? Hold on. Um, initiative, 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 initiative. It's three, this so... Bitch knows it's real did Cal roll a natural 20? Did I hear that right? Yeah, natural 20. Exactly. Why is Cal so fucking lucky, dude? Cal's got the fucking vibes. Alright, where's the initiative? Okay. We'll add that form. I'm using my um my metal uh critical roll dice that I got at the one live show I went to. Ooh. And it the first time I ever rolled it, the first time I ever tried rolling it, it rolled an at twenty. So nice. amazing. That was me with the, the Oh it's your lucky dice. That's me with the um their opalite set, the wild mount one mm -hmm. that was limited edition. Mm. Yeah. That one's been I wanted really that lucky one so for me. bad. Yeah, I wanted that one so bad, but I didn't like I didn't have the money when it came out and yeah. like I said limited. <laughs> yeah. No, it was expensive. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I got really lucky cuz when I went to I went to the live show for um um the Darrington Brigade. Mhm. Mm uh and they had the metal dice on sale for pretty fucking cheap. Nice. Yeah, no, yeah. those dice are really nice. I like them. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're they're gorgeous. Mm -hmm. I'm okay. upset. I I destroyed my my box for my nice opalite ones. Um. <sighs> All right, it is Cal's turn. Um. I, you would be aware that something just happened. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh... Hmm. I will say you are able to jump over these tables and crates with a successful acrobatics check. All right, I will attempt to do that. Uh, I'm good at acrobatics, right? Okay, I had to check. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> thought I was. Uh, yeah, Cal's gonna attempt to get over there. All right, go ahead. Uh, seventeen. Yeah, I'll do. You can... I had it minimized. I was like, where the fuck is this turn order? But there it is. <laughs> <laughs> Quick oh, yeah, little yeah. Uh, hop, step, and a leap. You can make your way across the um, table as long as you have movement, which I'm sure you do because you have movement. Yeah, I've got 30 feet, so. Okay. Uh, so I technically can only get there then. You can still hit her from there. Yeah. You're just not blanking. Uh, yeah, so Cal's gonna whack her with the claw. And I will say, Cal, um, you, looking at this woman, you remember something that your um, informant, shall we say, told you about um, the murderer. Um, right. Which it was the nature of what they were. And you're like, ah. Right. Right, 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 right. I I understand what that means now. Uh huh. You also understand why Bovius did not react to you having claws. You do. <laughs> you do understand why Borvius did not react to you having claws as well. This bitch has claws. <laughs> he may yeah. not have reacted to me having claws, but he sure reacted to me stabbing him. <laughs> yeah. Yes. True. All right. Uh, Cal will attempt to stab. Go for it. Uh, that's a. What's my? 
already forgotten all my stats. Where's my oh, combat that's... abilities? Um. Oh wait, I need to add the motherfucker. Alright, so 17. 17? Fuck, me Teresi. That's... Suck it? Yeah, it hits. Okay, didn't know what the Pathfinder was. Yes. Uh, 8 points of damage. 8 points of damage, okay. Um, gee, that's reasonable cool. compared to 20. <laughs> it's still not great. Okay, 8 points of damage. Uh, okay. Uh, also, hmm. Should I rage? Should I yes. rage? I yes, you rage. should. Rage. I think I'll rage. Do what you need to do. <laughs> Is raging a swift action? Yes. Okay. Yes, check it. Uh, or... I, I, know, I know I can do it without it being a full action. I can't remember if it's... Hold on. I didn't, of course, write this down, because that's not useful at all. I will I say, know. if you're taking a swift action, I'm just let's just cut it out there. I'm not going to let you take your second attack right now. That's fine. <laughs> because uh, otherwise, do you, it, you would be unimaginably broken. <laughs> that That is more than fine. Uh... Yeah. Uh. Oh, it's a free action. Oh! Why? <laughs> fucking, are you kidding me? It's fine. I, I only wanted to take one attack against this person anyway, so. Okay. <laughs> God, All right. Pathfinder, why? <laughs> I'm gonna strangle you. I'm... Stop! I fall. In blood <laughs> rage, I'm gonna. Blood, I'm going to. Blood rage. Going you to... can enter a blood rage as a free action. I'm gonna. I'm gonna kill you, so you're not playing a blood rage anymore. Like my backup <laughs> character would be any less amusing. Oh no, it would be amusing, but it wouldn't be a blood rager. So. God. All right. Is that is that your turn then? Yes. Okay. Uh, so, suddenly the vibes coming off Cal are real fucking weird. Uh, weird vibes. He's watching the you. Vibes. <laughs> Rancid vibes. Oh Rancid vibes. Well, Cal is generally pretty, pretty easygoing and good humored. Mm hmm. And all of a sudden, the clouds, not that anymore. The clouds have come. Feel them. Oh, yeah. All right. It is. I was almost to be like Skylar. It's your turn. I am playing Skylar right now. So <laughs> Skylar is going to attempt to acrobatics their way up onto the boxes over here, so they can get a flank. Um. Which I have Skylar's sheet open somewhere. There we go. Do you have decent acrobatics? Eh. Oh no. I feel so bad. <laughs> this is my second nat one of the night with these dice. Oh. Um, so Skylar does not make it up onto the boxes. Um, and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call that their turn. I'm just I'm just gonna say that. That makes it easier for me. I'm so sorry, Jamie, if you're listening to this. I'll make I, it'll be better at some other time. The bl the blow the the blow to the self esteem was too much. The ego is a little too hard. Um it's bruised. Alright. It is now That's actually a lie. It's Rebella's turn, not the Skulk's turn. So, she is. Are you still carrying the armor? Uh, not. I mean, Cal has you like. It? No, not wearing it. I do better on arm. Or no, I'm already wearing armor. Sorry, wrong thing. Uh, mm -hmm. no, Cal is like 
attached it to his to their um like pack or something. Okay. I don't know. She sees I'm this. sure I'm sure the noise oh, going over the, the boxes was unconscionable. Oh yeah. She <laughs> sees the armor that you have attached to your pack. Her and she recognizes armor. it. Yep. <laughs> and she says <laughs> Oh, if you've killed my husband, you're going to regret it. And she rolls like shit again. <laughs> you're going oh to regret my it. God. We're going to miss. Rebella. <laughs> I'm going to scream. New dice. <laughs> Fuck this shit. I love um, this. She's going to make her second attack. <laughs> please, 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 please. Are you fucking kidding me? What's your What's your AC, Co? 16. Fuck you, okay. <laughs> You're, she's so cool! She's such a cool character! Have her go after I mean, Sim next time. <laughs> in the context of, of Cal, uh, she yeah, probably a- does she probably does she probably does hit, but Cal is wearing uh, their funky little coat. Um, <laughs> which doesn't look like it should be able to hold up um because it's basically like this leather duster almost with a bunch of like metal and shit woven in uh but it's surprisingly fucking sturdy yeah so her she makes one swipe with the claws slides off one swipe of the swipe of the claws you duck out of the way and she looks fucking pissed. Um, does she have anything for her swift? Mm. No, she does not. Okay. Then it is now the person on the um, catwalk. On the catwalk. Um, Shit. Is going to kick over a jar on the catwalk. Oh, no. um, and knock it onto the floor. Where is my precious, precious little boy? How high up is the catwalk, out of curiosity? Um, no. No. Absolutely not. Um, it's probably... (laughs) It's probably... Let me see. What does it say? 15 feet off the ground. God damn it. So, you know. (laughs) Ah. Interesting. No, I don't like that. Stop it. Interesting. No. 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 Um, so the, actually the person does move before they do this. They come this way on the catwalk and kick over the jar that is there. And it spills, um, or it breaks and spills, and uh, it's just a, a puddle of slime on the floor. <laughs> Simply, simply a little puddle of slime. Slime. That's, that's all. That is all. That's all it is. Just some slime. Hmm. I believe so. That I'm adding to the turn order for no reason. Oh, good! You're just adding turn order so we can... You just, some of us are already a little bit injured, right? Oh, yeah, I do. Hi. I know. It's gonna be fine, don't worry about it. Speaking of, I... does anyone- does anyone remember for sure how much damage I took? Because my, uh, thing did not save exactly how much damage I took this time. Uh... I want to say... I think I only hit you once. It was only like three or four points, but I can't. I think it was three hit points that you took. Yeah, I think you took three because I took four. So I think. Okay. 
Yeah. Cool. Yeah, because my my sheet didn't save it for some reason. Mm. I so I couldn't remember the exact number. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Rusty. Alrighty. So now that is all that the skull. Oh, actually. Yeah, the skulk is going to make a stealth check and ducks down beneath the um, the sort of railing of the catwalk, and you do not see it anymore. Hmm. Um, Aya. Right, sir. Are you are you about to make me cry? <laughs> I can be a specifically about the movement rules. Uh-huh. Never a good sign. Can <laughs> I run if I have to say perhaps do some climbing and some jumping? <laughs> the sign. Oh, I want you to look at my face. You say hop onto this table in these crates, can I take a running jump and catch the catwalk? If you're prepared to make an acrobatics check for me, then, Joe, yes, you may. <laughs> Absolutely, I'm prepared to make an acrobatics check for you. Yes. I'm so heartbroken. <laughs> hey, it's better well, than a grapple check. This. <laughs> Neither do you or Asta are particularly mobile. But I have this. You- you you gave us the permissions to have these characters, PK. <laughs> I did, and then I thought I'd be able to roll better than a one every time. <laughs> better than a four, even. That's all I really want. It's better than a four. <laughs> no right. Huh? Does a twenty-six get me up onto the cat? I guess. Yeah, I'll allow that. <laughs> I suppose a twenty-six could do it. Sure. <laughs> God. Fine. <laughs> Fine if you must. If you must get onto the fucking catwalk, then I suppose a 26 is what you might need to accomplish such task. So where on the catwalk are you trying to go? That's why it's about if I'm going to have to do that acrobatics, can I um use a run? Because I want to get to... Roughly where that jaw was when it fell. Okay, so you're trying to go around here. Uh-huh. Yeah. Um, <coughs> we'll say you can make that because these are the higher boxes anyway, and it would have made sense. Which is kind of, well, it happens a little bit sad because Skylar tries to do like a quick little hop, step, and a leap up onto the boxes here and fails miserably. And then I use sprint, leap, Jump up off of this box, catch the catwalk, and swing yourself up onto it. God. Every action, Cal applauds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Victor Victor is looking a little respectfully. As a treat. So just a little bit of like a nice <laughs> on <Entrance>. nice. <laughs> That that that's a that's my excuse for Victor rolling a four initiative. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Victor, you were ready to go, and then oh, okay, sure, okay, all right, okay, okay, all right, all right. Um, okay, so Aya, you can you can place yourself up on the catwalk. Um, Fantastic. Which means I possibly might not have need to needed to run actually. Oh yeah, I would have in order to. Yeah, I'm going to say, because of the nature of that, I'm going to say it was going to require. I will say, though, that um, that was the wrong thing. Sorry. Um, Because you put yourself on the catwalk, you can make another uh, perception check. Actually. Or the catwalk. Or... Oh... I love that my nonsense gave um, 
Sorry, words. I love that my nonsense gave a meta reason. It gave an in-universe reason. What'd you get on your perception? 27. 27? Yes. You do not see a skulk. Yep, I figured. I figured they were looking at 30 plus, but, um, she saw something kick something down. It's a fair guess. You don't think that they probably could have gotten off the catwalk in this time unless they jumped, so you're pretty sure there's something up there with you. You just don't know where it is. All right. It is now... Listen, she has her way. It won't be up on the catwalk for long. Oh, God. Yeah. It is Fern's turn. Odd. <laughs> I, um, I want... I want... To, I want to do. I want to do my thing. I want to dazing touch her. Okay, make a melee touch attack then. Okay, what do I add to that? You add your um. Hmm. Good question. Hold on. I was about to give you fifth edition rules. That's not how this works. Is it, is it my strengths? Um, I think it's either strength or dex, depending on which one is better for you. Let me see. It's my it's my dex. <laughs> okay. Sorry, I'm just double checking because touch attacks are it's okay. Something. I believe it's yeah. A touch attack. Okay. Normally, it would be your strength for a melee and a dex for a range, but I gave everybody weapon finesse as a feat, and, be and unarmed can count as um, light weapons. So, make an attack with your dexterity. Yes. And, and right just burn. my dex and, and nothing else, right? Your base attack bonus if you have one. Uh, you might not. I don't. Uh, I don't. I, yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Fuck me. Um, that's an eight. Total. Yeah. All right. Unfortunately, Five on the dice. Unfortunately, it does not quite hit. She's pretty fast. She's faster than you expect. None of you actually interacted with her in the shop, except for Aya and Victor, who have not been paying much attention to her. But she is not, uh, you know, behaving as, you know... A civilian woman behaves in combat, obviously, and she's very fucking fast. Quick like a cat. Um, but that is unfortunately not a hit. Maybe next time. Do you have anything else you would like to do? No. Okay. Uh, well, I don't- I don't think there's anything else I can do, because that's a standard action, right? Uh, I believe so, yes. Parker, I'm going to kill you! And then, remember who my backup is. I'm going to murder you! <laughs> right now! You, want... you have to pick a different backup, that backup doesn't work this early. Fuck. What was that? I'm killing Never Parker mind. for his crimes. L. Side. He he said Blorbius from my games is a furry, and that breaks two rules. Number one, mentioning Blorbius from my games. Number two, there was no previously established rules against furries, but I'm making one now. Previously <laughs> <laughs> established, then it was. Then there, and this was not breaking it. This was inciting the rule. So you cannot punish someone for a rule that didn't exist when they- But I'm punishing him for breaking the Blurbius from my games rule. Uh... Tell him, does that make your sister sad? Okay, fine. No murder for Parker. Murder for Victor. Anyway, it's Soot's turn. Hello? Um... I don't know. He doesn't know what the fuck to do in this scenario. He's not really a... Mm. 
He's just gonna... He's just gonna use his 30 feet of movement to just go, like, right here. And... Okay. And if anybody comes toward him, he'll smack him with his staff. <laughs> Since there's not much... Action? Can... Yeah. He will whack. Yeah. Make me a baby ac acrobatics check just to make sure you easily uh, make it. Unless you're... If you're... Hmm? Unless you want to just go around the corner like a normal person. Oh. You know what? I'll... Hmm... It's not gonna change how- No, he's just gonna go around it like a fucking normal person. Why- Why- Why, why would okay. we do those fancy actions? He could just walk! <laughs> Fair enough. Fair Whoa. enough. Motherfuckers right. leaping over tables. So it's just gonna walk around it. God. Alright. So... Get up on the catwalk! This yeah. is so funny. Okay. Anyway, hmm. it is, sorry, um, it is a little pile of slime's turn. Um, God, that it's horrible. And it, yes, and it can't go say hello to Aya because she's on the fucking catwalk, so it's just going to come say hello to Cat. So, so nice, hard. so friendly, it's just, it's just greeting you. Oh um, God, I really believe that. It's just, it's just saying hi. It has exactly enough movement to get to you because it's just a little slime. Um, I am going to okay. That does not hit your AC because <laughs> your AC is. Astronomical. And that is a 12. Oh no. Yeah, so, that don't hit. The swarm is there! The slime is there next to you, I guess. Cool. <laughs> With Victor, it's your turn. <laughs> Alright. Can, can Victor please uh, attempt to get on top of these boxes? Yes. Acrobatics that check. Oh, oh god. There we go. Check that acrobatics. Um, that is a 17 on the dice plus uh, another 2, so 19. 19? Alright. Very easily and gracefully. I mean, you're no Aya, but you're no Skylar either, so <laughs> what more could you ask for? I'm sorry, that was mean. That was my fault, too. I just. <sighs> anyway, you're up on there. What would you like to do? All right. Um. Hmm. I think I'd like to drop down behind uh, Miss Rebella. All right. Fair enough. Um. And Ow. then we are going to go ahead. Wait, hold on. Let me check the text of the spell. I'm not scurvying her. <laughs> no scurvy today. <laughs> I was oh, about to oh, take the time off. Fear on my in my chest. I was like, <laughs> he said text of the spell. I was like, you fucking know what that spell does, you motherfucker. <laughs> no, sorry, because I assumed inflict like wounds was an attack roll, not a, not a save, but it is a save. Uh, so please give me a will saving throw. Sure, I didn't know that about inflict light spoons. Uh, in <laughs> inflict light spoons, yes. Inflict light spoons is like minor assistance for your disability, right? Like, um, oh, totally. Fucking oh. hell. Oh. Rebella. Oh no. What'd she roll? A four on the dice because I keep rolling fours. This is a different dice. That'll that'll fail. That'll fail. It sure fucking will, won't it, bud? So Victor just kind of reaches out and like hand on her shoulder and mm -hmm. uh, 
Uh, that'll be... S Hold on. I need to... Pathfinder spells. Give me a second. That's fair. Uh, 1d8 plus point per caster level? That's a weird way of doing that. But that's six points of damage. Necrotic damage. Okay. And just... I really hate people who lie to me. <laughs> <laughs> I do All look right. completely different still. <laughs> yeah, you, you. She has. She does not know um, that you are from OSHA. She didn't really get a good enough look at Aya going flying over her head to understand that Aya is from OSHA. So these and are just. And Sid people. is also hiding behind the thing, so she doesn't but know where not the hell so, yeah. part of safety was. She in does there. not know these are the OSHA people, guys. She has no fucking clue. Lol. <laughs> She does not know the motion is here to kick her ass! She has no fucking idea. <laughs> You're violating All so right. many safety protocols! <laughs> oh my god, this is so fucked. Okay, is that your turn, Victor? Uh, yep, that's it. Uh, uh, actually, swift action, her tail reaches up into, like, her pocket and pulls out a knife, so she has a, a knife in both hands now. Okay. <laughs> nice. Okay. All right. That's a thing and I can do. That's my special I racial know. trait. I know it's a thing you can do. I am aware. <laughs> All right, Cal. Yeah, Cal's just going to do a wacka wacka. A wacka wacka. On our murderous cat lady. There's only one bitch with claws allowed in this vicinity, and it's Cal. Exactly. Okay. Uh, hold on. Let me check my Blood Rager stuff because I've already forgotten my. Uh, uh, um, you get plus forty of strength and constitution, so that's plus two bonuses to each of them. Yeah. Okay. So why do you know is... what the Blood Rager stats are, Joe? Because I've talked to Joe about it a bunch. It's all good. Uh, <laughs> I was afraid. Okay. I was like, you're not planning a Blood Ranger backup now, are you? <laughs> that would be okay, funny. So, to my that's, funky only, mm -hmm. that's only a 15 to hit. Only a 15 to hit. And it does not hit. Okay, I rolled. Finally a win for PK. <laughs> no, no, oh. it's okay. It's okay. I panicked. You, it does not hit. You are not technically flanking. Uh, but that's a 17 on the dice for 24 to hit for the second hit. Yeah, that'll, that'll do. That'll, be, you'll, you'll, that'll probably hit. <laughs> just maybe. Uh, just whoops. Bit. Whoops. Damage dice just yeeted off the table uh, for a uh, 9 damage. You fucking kidding me. Okay, okay. Yeah, alright. Good to know. What bonuses you get from... Yeah, I only okay. rolled a three on the dice. Very Good sad. Enough. Cool. Someone else better hit her before I kill her by accident. <laughs> anyway. <gasps> Let's... Is that your turn, then? Um... I don't care enough about that. Yeah, that's gonna be my turn. Okay. Um, and then... Technically tied with Skylar, I believe. It's going to be the second round, so this guy gets to come. 21. There we go. Um, there is so there's a door right next to you. There sure is. <laughs> um, some fun, fun, fun and spicy facts about that door. Well, that guy did not know where I meant him to go. Um, 
fun the fun and spicy fact about that door yeah. is uh, that it opens and there's a dude there. Well, shit. Um, so you do have a held action. You can immediately hit him with your staff if you want. Oh, this is perfect. You guys don't see him do this, but you can hear his staff go through the air. Just whoop. It makes like a weird song sound to it when he... Like a, a whistling sound, like a weird... If, if you've ever had those like tube things that you put above your head and when you spin them faster they make a different sound, like a different pitch... That's what it sounds like. And I'm gonna roll for him. <laughs> See if he fucking hits. Please, it would be so funny. Oh, <gasps> okay, what what is it to hit with this thing? What do I use? Uh, uh quarterstaff stats, so it would be your base attack bonus plus uh ba I don't know what is my base attack? I gotta see. Your ba your sorcery, your base attack bonus ain't shit, so hold Yeah. On. I think it's is it hold with on. do we use dex or Something I don't. Or uh, strength. I don't know if is quarterstaff a uh, light weapon. Or is um, it a... it's bludgeoning proficiency two-handed. Uh, assembly. It does not a light much. weapon. You'll use strength. So. Okay, yeah, then it would be strength, I think, because it's category two-handed proficiency simple. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So strength, but I got no modifier in strength, so it's just a straight roll. I think. Yeah. So that would be a 16 on the dice. Which hits. Roll damage. Yes! Cool. Okay. Um, that's d6 damage. Okay. That's not a lot, but it's still something. Oh, that was much. That was two points of damage. <laughs> that's okay. I mean, it's something. It's something. I don't think any Again. of these guys have a lot of hit points, so. <laughs> yeah. No. Sit doesn't have a lot either. I think God Ban bless. is in single digits. Yeah, he's That's he's got a nine. <laughs> That's okay. This guy has a short sword. Um, <laughs> shit. <laughs> That's. I think um, that's all Sit can do. Just fucking okay. hit them. That's. I mean, that was not. That was your reaction. So, yep. or that was your instant. Uh, that was your held action. Rather. Yep. So sorry. Uh, does a 16 hit your AC? Oh, for sure. I don't even have to look at my fucking AC. Yeah, 13 is my AC. Thank I, it God. hits. God, thank God I can hit somebody. <laughs> yeah, so I was like, just hit Soot. falling asleep in the back. <laughs> God. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you can kill him? <laughs> oh, wait, I rolled the wrong dice. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. That's still, that's still pretty good. That, that's gonna be six points of damage. <laughs> oh no! Uh, he's so, so... He's got three hit points, it's fine. He's fine. <laughs> it's fine. He, he's, he's had worse from... I uh, whatever, it's fine. He's had worse from Redacted. Eh. No. <laughs> I'm lying. But, yeah. Does he do anything else to soot? <laughs> give, give PK a second. Oh, I didn't see. No, they just sent the message. It's fine. Okay. This combat's going swimmingly. It is, for sure. Parts of this combat are going swimmingly, definitely. Mm-hmm. Hey, I don't know. I like I like getting my characters beat up. It's fine. <laughs> if you don't take any wounds in combat, it's not fun. <laughs> so it dies. The second it would have been a God. little bit funny if you could scurvy. Rubella. <laughs> So anyway, Sit dies. Um, oh Jesus! <laughs> just kidding, 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 kidding. The surprise! The knife had poor. The sword short. Sword. Sword short. What? Sword. <laughs> sword. Sword. sword, sword poison. Short. Fuck. It, it, it was. It was poisoned. Hit. 
Um, but no, it's not poisoned. Um, and you, oh, he does not get sneak attack. So, yeah, fuck my life, I guess. Um, and that is his turn. And so now it is Skylar's turn. Skylar. Skylar doesn't have a lot of options to really get around things very well. So to make another acrobatics check for them. Okay, that's fine. They're going to climb up around... Yeah, they're going to try this again, and it's going to work this time. Uh, I'm glad to hear that they were apparently inspired by Aya's... Yeah, like, Aya did her thing, Victor did the, her thing, and Skylar's like, well, I have, I have to... I have to, like, be able to get up on some boxes, dude. <laughs> As um, the other dyke, I have to do this. <laughs> I have to do this. Um, now the two dykes are both, um, you know, they, well, Victor's off the box, but Skylar's going to try to attack Rebella non-lethally and is going to miss, unfortunately. Um... And where is my precious, precious, little song. you know, where is my precious little turn order? I can't fucking find my turn order. Oh no. Uh, I found it. It was in the corner and hidden under the character sheets I had open. God bless. Okay. Oh, that's We amazing. can advance the turn order. Um, and we can... Play the fun game of what is Rebella gonna do? What is Rebella gonna do? She is surrounded by motherfuckers and bitches. Mm hmm. Might be good for you yeah. now if you just surrendered. Mm, she doesn't know about that though. I'm fine if she doesn't. And hit her some more. <gasps> she is going to take a full round action to. No. Fuck. The rules of attacks of opportunity are going to screw her over. Let me make sure, let me make sure I'm, uh, interpreting this correctly. Yeah, okay. Either way, she's gonna get fucked, but she's gonna try and do it this way. She's going to... Withdraw out this way, and in leaving Victor and Cal's uh, square, she is not threatened. You guys can't do attacks of opportunity because she just darts out of there so fast. But leaving Skylar and Fern's space, um, and trying to bolt to the ladder, she, uh, Fern and Skylar both get attacks of opportunity. Get her. her. Uh. I can't do my thing again. Is that does that count? Um, I, it doesn't say. No, I'm gonna say for the sake of this that you can't do it as an attack of opportunity. You do have your your bolas. My thing, though. my bolas. Yes. Okay, my bolas. Your bolas. I do the I do the those. Um, please for the love of God. Yeah. Nineteen. Ah. All right. Nineteen. Uh, Are you using that, your non lethal ones? Or I'm using lethal? my non lethal. Okay. I'm well, using my non lethal. 19, Nineteen hits. And she had one hit point left. Oh shit. One. She had one. <laughs> oh, if I had um, hit both times. And she <laughs> drops like a fucking stone. 
Um, I told her. I told her to to, to surrender. <laughs> anyway, um, it is now my fun special buddy's turn. Um, who is going to be fun and special and roll good, right? I'm get guys. I'm gonna kill. <laughs> oh no! I think I'm you deserve so to at this point. Play. Guys, guys. <laughs> you know what? What kill, number? Just, just kill Sid. It's fine. <laughs> what number is that? That's a four. That's a four. Do you know how many fucking fours I've rolled? I flipped dice twice. I'm using the online roller now. Oh. What do you mean? God. What do you mean? I roll another four. <laughs> And does that mean he's not visible? Well, she. No, shut, shut the fuck up, dude. Don't get. Let me. Let, I'm sorry. I that was too far. Let me mourn this for one second before I tell you yeah. that you see the fucking skulk. God. <laughs> <laughs> literally. Let's check out the skulk. Literally about to start screaming. You want to take a break? No, I, I'm being facetious. That this is, I'm not literally about to start screaming. I am, in fact, fine and think this is really funny. However, <laughs> frustrating. One guy has managed to hit, um, and it's my throwaway rogue. It's fucking Gary, who is falling asleep <laughs> in the office. <laughs> Look, um, Gary is much more talented than he's been telling the bosses. He just doesn't like to work. Uh, that, honestly, and Gary just wants to be able to take his naps in peace, and if they think he's incompetent, they're just gonna mostly leave him alone unless he egregiously fucks up. He I he's can't... just here for the paycheck. You know, he doesn't care about the cause, he doesn't care what these assholes are doing. He just wants his whatever a reasonable wage in D D slash Pathfinder is. Uh, and to go home at night or mm-hmm. in the morning. There's there's Gary lore now, I guess. Um, <laughs> anyway, there's a dude right in front of you, Aya. And, and now it's your turn. So, remember what you told you about how Aya's bird-trained response is kick it until it stops being a threat? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I do remember that. <laughs> She's going to flurry of blurs, and then, if this works, she's going to bull rush. Now, um, yeah, quick question about the bull rush. I think you need to. Hurricane punch. Hold on. Uh, it's in my sheet. Yeah, I'm just looking. Uh, did I actually? Yes, I did. Bull rush. Um. Yeah. What specifically the feat that I'm referencing? When you hit the same creature with unarmed attacks at least twice in the same round, you can attempt a bull rush combat maneuver against that creature as a swift action. You can also move with the target even if you have no movement remaining, but the distance you move can't exceed half your speed. Yeah. So um, she's gonna try and kick twice, and if she makes impact, she's gonna. Okay. We're gonna figure out the bull rushing works. Yep, I I I know how bull rushing works. Two and nineteen. What was the first one? Twenty-two. I. Yeah. Roll damage for those. Now, I do have a question about that bull rush. Which I will yeah. ask in two seconds. Yeah, just hand me your damage first so I don't so I know if you fucking killed this man before you bull rush him off the fucking fifteen points of damage. Fifteen? Oh shit. Fifteen? <laughs> That is hilarious. That's fucking hilarious. Okay, he's alive. 
Five. Spell rushing work. If you would have a combat maneuver, going a combat maneuver against his or her. So you um make a um a a uh, sorry. You were making a CMD versus CMD thing. So roll a combat maneuver. Roll a D twenty and add your combat maneuver bonus. Question. Do I have to push them straight, or can, can I say push, push them down the into this pile of crates? You can push him onto the fucking pile. Fuck you. Just, yeah. Sure. Push him Push him onto the, off the fucking catwalk. Just make your CM, CMB check. Uh, 18. I'm not actually expecting that to work because 18 is mine, and I'm assuming they're in a similar, where they're in a similar class as I am. No. Um. Wait, do I get just... Let me just check. Double check. Where are you, my beloved? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's make, let's make a check. And I don't target an attack of opportunity for that. Yeah, they do. No, I don't get one. It, it doesn't provoke one when I do that. Right. It doesn't? Yeah, it doesn't. It doesn't? Uh, well, using this feat, he doesn't provoke an attack of opportunity, even if he doesn't have the improved bull rush feat. I'm going to start screaming. Yeah, I just in a sheet if you want to verify. Yeah, I just didn't see that part with the in the in the hurricane uh specifically there's the hurricane punch feet and then further down there's hurricane punch X Winston. Which the very first paragraph of that has. Okay, well, anyway, I'm going to make an acrobatics check for this fucker to see if he can catch himself and not crunch on the ground. <laughs> Thank God. Um, so he falls. He catches himself. Can I follow? Because I can do that as part of the maneuver, is go with them in the shelf. Yeah, you're also going to have to make an acrobatics check to not Hopefully. take damage. So, you probably can't see, but there's these two kicks, and each of them swells up a little bit of, probably not dust, I assume this is used enough that there's not dust, a little bit of a breeze, and the second one makes impact, it catches, and off the edge, and that is a dirty 20 for my acrobatics. Okay, you're fine. Um, and you land on the ground next to them. keep knocking things off the thing. Yeehaw. Is that your turn? Mm, do I want to take five foot step? No. I love yeah. you. I guess, I guess you're all right sometimes. That was mean. I'm sorry. I don't mean it. Anyway, it's Fern's I, turn. I, I, uh, lady, what? What's happening? Um, the fuck conscious is what lady is. Cool. Um, you heard Soot whack somebody, and then probably heard a cry of pain from Soot's direction, and you can see because this is a lower table. You can see over here so you can see that there's something going on there. Yeah, the what, man's got stabbed with, the with a short sword. The blob is just kind of there. It did make is an it... attack on Cal. It, it sure tried, did. It, but it was so weak that it just kind of like vaguely moved in Cal's direction. So it, 
It's just a pile of slime that's kind of moving towards you guys, and it's pathetic, and I wish it was better. <laughs> it, it moved vaguely towards Cal and just sort of slid off of Cal's leg. Yeah, it did do that. <gasps> I, I don't... Can I hit it? Yeah, you can. You sure can, buddy. Roll. Eight, 18 for four 18. damage. Do you want to know? Do you want to know the AC on that bad boy? The AC Two? of the slide. Well, no, it's a seven. Let please, it's a seven. God. Um, oh, a seven. A seven. The Whoa. AC on that bad boy is a seven. How many? How much? Oh, four, four, <clears throat> four damage. Yes. It. It. It is a squished slime. It's still kind of moving. Ish. It's a pathetic little blob. Mm-hmm. Would you like to do anything else? Wait, yeah, make make a perception check. Make a perception uh, check. I forgot about this. Why? Fucking natural twenty again. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Okay. Well, yeah. So you see, you see. Where's my? Where's my? Where's my little meow meow? <laughs> you see over in... Sort of... Not not there. You're not there. I moved you. I didn't mean to move you. You see... Hiding... Sort of down this way. They mm-hmm. have been pressed up against these boxes. You see the skulk from earlier. It's not the one that Aya threw over the edge of the thing, obviously. The skulk you talked to earlier is just sort of awkwardly standing there. Like, she thinks maybe, maybe she's supposed to help in this situation, but also she really doesn't want to be here. <laughs> like, uh, that's fair. she has a sword in her hand, like she should be going to attack people with it. But she's there's everybody's getting their asses kicked and she's not about that life much like she was not before um so that is you notice that with a 26 okay she's like i avoided getting my ass kicked downstairs i think i'll continue that trend yes all righty then is, is that your turn If that is your turn, it's gonna be Soap's turn. He. Um, I think he staggers from the fucking short sword stab. Uh, Yeah, he did get a little stabbed. So just like kind of fucking grabs his side, just like fuck. Uh, (laughs) Um, and as like His hit didn't happen very well when he smacked the guy, so he's just gonna raise his hand out and just be like, Matches! <laughs> um, and he's going to- Matches! Yeah, he's going to summon his dog. <laughs> dog. It, it is, for for people to know, it is, dog. it is basically this lanky black borzoi that, like, appears if he wants to. Uh, he does. But, he, s- he, s- he, yeah. He does. He shows up. Okay, good. But uh, he is summoning his his buddy um, in the hopes that he'll take a chomp out of the guy. Maybe. <laughs> All right. Um, the melee that's is your a summon. Yeah, it's a bite summon. plus two with a d four plus one for the. Uh, we'll see. Okay. We'll see. <laughs> I'll roll for him. Hmm? Go ahead and make the roll. Ooh, okay, that's a... Ooh, that's not very good. That's a... That's a 15? Oh, wait, no, wait, that's a plus 2. That's a 16. A 15 will hit this, uh... Oh, my God. Okay, cool. So that's a d4. Where are my d4s? 
Come here, big dog. He is horse. Ooh, and that's max damage, so that would be five points of damage. Five points of damage. All right. Goodest um, boy. Fight. Um, this this rogue uh, is not downed by it, but he is alarmed and in pain by it. And ah, fuck. And clearly, uh, Match has put the hurting on this guy. Good boy. Good dog. Good boy. Good dog. Then he's he's got his like fucking staff in front of him, trying to like keep the distance, but he can't attack mm -hmm. this round, so that's all Sid can do. Okay. Good job, matches. Yeah, goodest boy. Okay. The slime is gonna try and get Victor next, I guess. Victor, right. what's your AC? Uh, it is. Hold on. A 15? I'm bad. Okay. The slime moves pathetically in your direction. <laughs> and... It is your turn. Victor sees this with one of the knives that she's holding. She's going to flick it and then cast a magic weapon on it. Okay. Um, actually, no, she's not because that takes up my action and that's dumb. Um, okay. She's not going to uh, do she, that. She's just going to stab it. Go ahead and stab it. I'm still learning my sheet. That's okay. Uh, 21? Yeah, it has a 7 AC, so yeah. Uh, 5 points of damage as just knife into, like, the fleshiest bit of the slime. 5 will do it. Good job tag-teaming there, Fern and Victor. You killed my slime. <laughs> you solved my Hell. slime puzzle. Violence. Kill. Kill. Violent. <laughs> I think Victor, with that, is just going to uh, step over. Uh, give give Aya whatever like a flanking bonus she wants, and just. All right, friend. I'll give you the same option. Best surrender now. Good to know. All right, it's. Is that your turn? Yeah, that's my turn. Okay. It's Cal's turn. Yeah, Cal's gonna diddy bop their way over here. And, uh, is going to say to this unfortunate man, Gary, uh, you're not looking so good. I figure I'll give you the chance to surrender. Since we already got your bosses. Or I could just gut you if you try anything. And is gonna hold an attack for if Gary like tries to like attack either okay. Sil or Cal. Okay. Or anyone else, I guess, but th since they're the only two that are standing there, you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. Um it is Gary's turn. Gary drops his fucking short sword immediately. Yes! So what I thought. You say, you say, or I could gut you, and before you finish the word gut, his sword is on the ground. <laughs> sword on the ground, hands in the air. Very good. Appreciate your cooperation. Much more agreeable than the end of another sword sword. Fuck! <laughs> Third again. Third shirt. <laughs> yeah, you know. Sort shirt. Sort shirt. Uh, I can't even <laughs> say it right. It, it's the Sir dyslexia. Sort <laughs> shirt. Um, sorry. <laughs> no, it's funny. You can make fun of me for that one at least. <laughs> I I will. God bless. Um, sort shirt. Okay. Then it Fuck is you. now. <laughs> It's now Gary's not doing anything. Gary is waiting patiently for further instructions. Um because Cal's claws are covered in blood right now. Um 
And it is Skylar's turn, and Skylar is going to go and start uh, tying up Rebella Manchella, um, who is unconscious. Is this? Yeah. So this is this is the skulk that Aya and Victor have penned in. And hmm. Victor, can you make a diplomacy check for me? For what you uh, can. what you suggested to them? Uh nine on the dice, but plus an eight, so a seventeen. Okay. My favorite thing about Pathfinder that has changed you all as people is that you love to say instead of just saying like a seventeen. You love to say, here's the low number I rolled. Here's the high number I got anyway. Because you guys love to flex those Pathfinder bonuses. Because big number, big number good. Big number good. Yeah. Big, yeah, they Big fuck. number. Big number sexy. I said that was my favorite thing completely unironically. It genuinely makes me so happy. Because I do that too. <laughs> yes. Uh, big number. Big number good. Okay. I'm not just gonna say I, 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 Yeah. I do it. I do it. A 25 on a stealth check. I'm gonna say, oh, I rolled a nine for a 25 on a stealth check. Um, <laughs> I, I did this in D and D too on stuff that I have like proficiency in. Yeah. <laughs> God bless. Okay. Big number. So, like, it's oh, nice oh, to I pretend that you're you have the mortal this? numbers. <laughs> well, this skulk looks at you. And says, Are you gonna kill me? Not if you give up right now. Are you gonna send me to jail? It depends on how cooperative you are. Cute. No, really. We need as many witnesses against Miss Rebella and her husband as possible. The skulk drops their sword. Appreciate it, sweetheart. The skulk looks <laughs> fucked up, by the way. Like, if on a scale of like six, 1 to 16, they look like they're rolling at about a 1. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Um, can, can I do any? No, are we still in combat? Um, as of right now, you guys have neutralized all the, uh, threats on yes. my map, except for one that is not decided. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. Can Fern do something real quick? Yes. Fern is going to, the one that's not doing anything is going to make eye contact and then make a head gesture like, what are you doing? Get out of here. <laughs> All right. Okay. Do I have to your friend that, or you can, you can, you can your friend that. I think. Yeah, but is, I'm scared. I mean, you did already your friend this one last it session. Is, you are already this one's uh, friend. Um, that's so true. If, if you always to make, continue to be their friend. If you want to make a diplomacy check, um, with an additional plus two bonus on top of your normal one, then yes. Additional plus two. Twenty two. Okay. They and your perception from earlier stands, so you can just barely see as they shift and melt back into the surroundings, you can just barely see their outline moving away again. But they are gone awesome all right and now 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 you all have some people you have one skulk you have gary you don't know his name is gary you have rebella you know her name is rebella um and 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 so it's fucking beat to shit dude 
Yeah, he's bleeding. Uh, <laughs> he's like holding this, his side, but he's like partially leaned towards Cal because of it. Like, fuck, dude. <laughs> This uh, uh, do you mind uh, securing our friend here? I can do that. Uh, clarity out of character. Do you mean the skulk or do you mean the skulk? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Gary's gonna stay where he is. No, no I think our I think they went for our friend. <laughs> God. Simply oh. secure our friend. <laughs> They're secure. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm They're so secure right now. <laughs> Out of yeah. curiosity, how tall is Soot? Um, he's five four or five eight. Wait, he's five six. Five six. You're right, because he's half. Of, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. He's not super short, but he's like. Semi average, or maybe a little bit shorter. Cal is four inches shorter than him. Lol. <laughs> the hat adds Cal, four more inches. Cal is a short king. <laughs> hmm? I had forgotten Cal is a short king. Shorty's got to stick together. <laughs> Cal... Five six is not short. Fuck off. I know it's not. <laughs> I'm five two. You think? <laughs> <sighs> I'm five You're four probably. in real life, so God, I'm... I am short. Solidarity. Uh, we are shaking hands. <laughs> we are. Uh, Cal is going to look at Gary and be like, "Now you keep yourself nice and calm. Come on back to the rest of us." And is then going to like duck under Soot's arm to try and support. <clears throat> This person who is actively bleeding. <laughs> Thank you. You can, you can support Soot. He is not a yeah. insanely heavy man. You can sort of help him limp back over to the others. Gary has like his hands behind his back, just kind of <laughs> awkwardly following yeah. you. Like, yep, absolutely, sir. Soot, Anything you say, sir. Soot might be using <laughs> Cal to just like uh fucking be support but he's got his staff trained on this guy like if you move i'm gonna whack you with it like <laughs> don't try yeah, me that looks bad cal, cal seems completely unconcerned by uh gary the not a threat how bad does it look <laughs> he's on three, three hit, hit points, points out of nine <laughs> ah uh fern is going to step over to Soot and and sort of, and look at him and just say, "Um, are you are you all right if I cast a spell on you? Do you mind?" Depends if it'll turn my hair green. Don't really want that to happen, do I? <sighs> it's oh it won't don't worry it, at least it shouldn't it hasn't yet there's always time you know oh, um, what type of and, are you gonna and <laughs> uh, <laughs> just just a just a light healing if that's all right all I just right. want to make sure you're all right uh and Fern is gonna cast cure light wounds yo all right cure those um, light wounds. Cure those light wounds. So yep. <laughs> those light wounds. Oh, I forgot it. I forgot I had just gotten two potions. Huh. It's fine. Keep them for it's later. Like, please. Yeah. Oh. Okay. That is. Fuck me. Uh, that's three points of healed. Hey, that's pretty good. You have least for since his current HP total. His current HP is uh. Fuck. Um, I... Oh, his wounds thing didn't save, but that's fine. He he How is I... back oh. up to six, so we're good. You've instantly doubled yeah. his, his HP. Yeah. He's feeling a lot better. Yep. Oh. So there, Ooh. there's the in-character class reveal. Cleric moments. Cleric um. moments. Victor is gonna go, excuse me, I'm gonna check on our friends downstairs, and just 
pop down real quick, see, make sure those dwarves are still holding on to those captives pretty good. Alrighty, I'm not gonna move you back to the other map. Um, That's fine. Uh, the the dwarves um, are they are sort of one of them is sort of near the ladder because he heard sounds and noises um but the other one like he looks up at you and is like uh everything all right up there uh yeah everything's just fine had to handle the last bit of business um no one's dead everything's fine well that's encouraging he does not sound Uh, encouraged um (laughs) Our friends still, uh, happily in place? Well, you know, they're where they are. A bit too unconscious to call them happy. More than fine with my, in my book. Uh, we'll be making a decision about, uh, getting back to the sheriff soon, don't worry. Oh, all right. Hey, do you mind if I ask you something? Uh, sure. What? You're, uh, you're, uh, with, um... You know, right? Victor does not pause this way. Um... Mm -hmm. Also, there's kitty camera if anyone would like. Kitty has to lick. Mm hmm. She did just sneeze. That's part of why she's. Oh. Look at her. I think. I think Victor's response is. Well, now. I wouldn't know much about that sort of thing. But we're certainly with people who are interested in seeing you safe. The, the implication he, of yes, but we don't talk about it. <laughs> he makes he makes a little bit of a face and then make a uh, make a bluff check for me to see how well you carry your innuendo here. Yeah. Uh, that would work in southern. So. Uh, eighteen. Eighteen. All right. He nods. He nods, and and he says, "All right, I assume we'll be uh, talking a little more later about, you know, favors and compensation." But I'll I'll wait I'll wait down here. Appreciate it. Yeah, I'll let you know when it's good to talk. All right. And he goes. He goes back to presumably where he is sitting down there and watching. Alrighty, uh, Victor is going to pop her head back up, and the very like, well, everyone out there, down there, still out cold. That's okay. Very sure. I also so how go. Do want to do this? Cal has been tying up. Definitely our friendly furry over there. Mm. Um, yeah, Skylar has it. successfully tied the furry. Um, okay. Woo! Uh, uh, but Cal can probably help in the... He has how to avoid her being able to use her claws to get out of that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, C- Cal will check on that particular aspect. Uh, in- unless anyone objects, Cal is going to leave Gary uh, unaccosted. Um, so it'll keep an eye levels on him. him <laughs> le- levels him with a very, like, even look. Um. Oh. Cal does freeze for a solid minute as they go Tharn as their blood rage fades. Um. Oh, Tharn. But shakes it off without comment. Um. Almost forgot about that. Um. Soot does give you a bit of a look at that. Um. He, he's mulling something over, but he doesn't say anything. Mm-hmm. But, uh, we'll, we'll give Gary a very level look and be like, Now, I don't expect you to cause any trouble, but, uh, we can leave you with your hands free as long as 
You keep it civil, yeah? Gary is standing there in this pose, like hands like this, just... <laughs> he, is, just... he is not touching anything, he's not reaching for anything. Gary is just standing here. Gary is just standing here. So don't, like, do that side, like, grab him on the shoulder and give him a little bit of a pat and just say, Would be a shame to bring matches back, Yuri. <laughs> 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 would be a shame. Sure, sure would be a shame. Sure yeah, would be a shame. He just wouldn't gives him another. Any shames on the shoulder. Yep. 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 <laughs> yep. <laughs> got to terrorize yep. a man because he did stab Soot. Just a. Li He's just got to terrorize him a little. Payback. <laughs> yep. Oh, also, unless you were right next to Soot, um, so Cal, Cal's probably the only one who saw the dog. Nobody else saw the dog. Mm -hmm. Um. Because the dog went away very quickly because he yeah. got tired. He he only they lasts an action. It's or a uh, round. It's sad. A round. He lasts six seconds. Yeah. Um. So, in this context, he only lasts six seconds. Mm -hmm. Um. And he didn't feel like sticking around. God yeah. bless. Yeah. He did what he came there to do. Come out. It matches. What's up? Did matches react at all to Cal? That's a good question. Isn't it? That is a good question. It is, it is a good question. Did matches it's react right. to Cal? Hmm. Yes. Yeah? Just a little. Just a little. Okay. Bristles okay. just a little bit. Hat oh. was okay. raised just a little bit before fading away. Hmm. Brief, I feel like that would have been... Oh, sorry. Just brief moment of, like, Cal's shoulders, like, getting tense before <laughs> they readjust themselves. So you're obviously the only one who notices. Yeah, I think that probably would have been the reason why he considered you for a moment when you went stock still. Uh. Um... Well, we have these people. We have a lot of their written plans. We have people who can testify. Should I and Detective Locke go get the... She keeps her tone very neutral. Um, I don't think she has the fan up, so you can see the little bit of an expression that is there. Go and get the sheriff so that we can deal with- finish dealing with our part of this. Sounds good to I'd me. I'd be amenable like... to that. Gary is sweating. <laughs> uh, I really wish Aya was the type to go, you take care, y'all take care now, but she's not. Could have chosen um, a better um, line of work. <laughs> Look. Where I mean, yes, but also it I mean it pays better than the fucking docks, dude. Sure does. But uh I risk high reward high. It's not even that high reward, dude. It's just the hours are good. Sorry you got caught. I don't know. I'm- I literally just chill in the office. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Justification I'm... for being an accessory to murder, but I'll take it. I- I, so I was wants. not involved in any murders or anything. Yeah, well, you're I, still sitting I in the was... office. Still ads. We're still a legitimate business, dude. <laughs> like, we're still a shipping and handling company. <laughs> so trucks um, again. I'm, <laughs> um, I'm do, sure. I'm sure if they're, you testify against your lovely bosses, they're not that lovely. I don't like them that much. <laughs> your horrible bosses. <laughs> there will be some leniency with you involved in the uh, less dubious side of things. 
Maybe I'll get off with community service. I can do effortless. I can do community service. I mean, I can serve a community better than most, most, most people. I think. I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Sorry, by the way, about I just. I'm sorry. I yeah, I did stab. I'm sorry about that too. It did react oh, to just no. a stranger standing at your door by stabbing him. That's not a very good response. <laughs> yeah. He was he was responding to a break in to give him credit. Yeah. Skyla, Skyla, Isle, would you would you go running? Yep. All right. Yep. Uh, in the meantime, Victor is going to pop back downstairs. Okay. Uh, and poke her head into the to the to the door through the door, and sort of at the dwarf like, now and ever. All right. Um, what is? I I had a different accent, but Victor's gonna make himself in anyway, so he's southern now. <laughs> um. All right. I mean, uh, I mean, we've never dealt with you in particular before. Um, obviously. Uh, is there, uh, you're all a group. Yeah, we are. Collective, collective, uh, collective exchange for the favors. We can start with that, yeah. <laughs> all right. Um, we normally... Um, we normally, uh, work with, do you know, do you know, uh, Navi? Ever work with reputation. her? reputation. Make a book check. <laughs> uh, that is a 24. Ooh. Okay. He nods, he nods. Yeah, she's, you know, she's great. Um, but... I think, technically speaking, you're going to have to talk to her um, with regards to everything else. Anything we can do for you personally, of course, is it, we're happy to do so, but we are more merchantile and you all seem more on the mercenary end of things, so I'm not sure how much exchange we could give you there, but now they could certainly arrange for something i'm sure i mean you'd have to give me contact info for i mean i can probably i have been a little bit imprisoned um but yeah I can... understandably but eventually no yeah i know where she normally we are she normally is established, I'm sure you know, not too far, just farther inland, so it should be not too difficult to get arranged with her. I can give you my calling card and verification, and then you can work it out with her directly. That sounds lovely. All right. Sounds, sounds good, sounds good. Um, and, of, of course, anything personally that we can we can we can manage for you but we're um at more experts in clockwork engineering than we are in um one of my companions will like, want to talk to you a little bit more about the uh, details of your kidnapping right of course of, you know of, of course of course of course that makes sense and, and on top of that uh, she kind of cracks her neck like she's thinking um, contact info, your calling card, general cooperation with the police. Right. <laughs> Absolutely. Can. Are you gonna be. I mean, is the. Are the police. Is there. Is it gonna be. Are, are people coming? Are law enforcement coming? Like to deal with this? Because this, there's a lot going on in here. That we are con uh, two of my companions are contacting the sheriff's office as we speak. We weren't even the only ones they had in there. They had some other guy in here a while back. Anyway, you might want to might want to give that information to the police. And my friend is going to be asking you questions. 
of course and I can um, just as soon as um, maybe if we can get our things back if our possessions have not been you know redistributed but either way I'll get you, I'll get you verification grand uh, I might be wearing a different face when you find me just look for Victor all right sure what, whatever floats your boat <laughs> come on a little bit of disguise magic don't want these folks down here seeing my face I wear a fair enough fair enough I just again merch don't really normally deal in your end of things it's just you know favors fair enough fair enough sure came this in handy this shortly. time this hmm? will be back shortly just hold tight appreciate it Victor's gonna head back upstairs. Okay. Carrying a little bit of information. Certainly have some information of some kind. Can mm -hmm. Sip poke around in the office, please? <laughs> yes. You can. Um, um, in in this here, I'll just open up the whole or I'll go reveal the whole um, thing. Alright. Um the office has office shit in it. Mm -hmm. Um it currently the back room um like this area the D3 area does look like a, there's like a comfy armchair, there was like a mug sitting on a side table in there and like a a little a little desk where clearly work was meant to be being done but Gary was obviously taking a nap. Yeah. Um, And uh, inside the actual office proper, there are there's filing cabinets. There are folders full of, uh, you know, inventory catalogs and and several uh, contracts and um, a a policy book, and it all looks very um, like a shipping and handling company documents. Yeah. I you can roll curious. a perception check to see if there's uh, anything more interesting than yeah, that. Yeah, I was curious. What is that? Ooh, that? What was that? An investigation? A, a perception. A perception does not exist in this game. That's right. I forgot. Oh god, his perception is not good, but he did roll higher. Um, That would be a 16 perception. 16? He has a minus okay. one. <laughs> God bless him. Um, <laughs> you do discover, walking through the area, not just the office, you do discover that there is another trap door in D4 that appears to lead down to a different room. Um, the room that you fought Borbius in, actually. Mm. Um, so maybe if Gary hadn't been taking a nap, he would have noticed that and been able to jump down and assist, but um, he was mm. sleeping. God bless. God bless, Gary. God bless. Um, beyond that, you mostly, it you can confirm, it seems like this area was was meant to be a mm -hmm. legitimate part of the business front and didn't contain any other interesting documents. You There is a bowl of mints on the desk you can steal from if you want. Oh yeah, he's taking a handful of mints. <laughs> Let's go. The sign says take one, but you don't give a fuck. Nah, he takes ten. <laughs> Incredible. Alright, anybody else doing anything in the warehouse? Uh, Cal's gonna pat down, um, Rebellia? Rebella. Oh, uh, Rebella. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm really bad with names. You're um, good. Uh, yeah, they're gonna, they're gonna search her for shit. Okay. You find on her another two potions of Cure Light Wounds. Aha! Collection. Nice. Um, <laughs> a dagger. A... The bracers on her arms seem very fine and not altogether mundane. Um, 
but you're not sure what they are. They are magical, I will tell you that. Um, on a leather cord around her neck, there are two keys. Um, she also has a um, gold wedding ring with a very fine diamond in there. Um, that looks like it could fetch a pretty price if you're going to steal a woman's wedding ring. Um, and what else does she have? She has a bunch of vials um, in various um, places and pockets on her person. Empty. Full of small quantities of liquid. Are those similar? Yeah, she's a fucking alchemist! Ah, that that would make sense considering the vial we found on the other... whatever it was before. Yeah, they are- the vials are identical to the three vials that you, you found in, um, the circus tent uh, at the site of Sister Ezrelda Woodmere's murder. Alright. And Cal, make an intelligence check for me. Okay, give me just a sec. Okay, intelligence. Go away, D6. I don't need you anymore. <laughs> um, um, let's, where's my intelligence? Um, three, that makes it a dirty 20. Dirty 20? Okay. So, step one, you can recognize easily that one of the keys on her neck seems to match the make of the lock on the vault door downstairs. Uh, the second thing you know is that after Archiv and Walder's murder, nobody could find his master key to the locked box. And you're not sure what that key looked like, but you have two keys here, and only one of them is accounted to, accounted for with a door. So. Hmm. Okay. Cool. Just a thought. Suspicious. Um. Do I steal this woman's wedding ring or not? No! <laughs> <laughs> she gonna need it in prison? <laughs> Kidding. She's allowed a token I know, of I'm joking. Marriage. I'm joking, God. <laughs> yes, but is gonna lose her shit if you try that. No, it would never. God. But well, Cal is but the real Cal. question here. It would be funny, though. <laughs> but it would be oh. sad. Sure, take a woman's wedding ring. Hey, I mean, they are nah. possibly involved in a uh, shipping live human situation, so. And also a killing live human situation. Yeah. But. <laughs> I am distinctly I get anti stealing a one wedding ring. Yeah. I'm just gonna keep I'll... giving you guys wedding rings that you could possibly steal to catch you, to test your moral character. <laughs> I mean, the thing about that is, I don't have any moral character. <laughs> so my knee is. You my do knee. that, I'm gonna start a collection. <laughs> I'll just wear a necklace with a bunch of wedding rings on it. <laughs> oh That's so fucked up, dude. That's really so fucked up. fucked up. That's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna make you fight like a big bad and you're gonna take their wedding ring and it's gonna be a traumatic. Oh my god. <laughs> Not Cal, Cal considers wedding ring when you can get someone to give you a wedding ring. <laughs> there you go. Cal considers uh stealing this this wedding ring. Um and then it's like, no, I already got enough shit. I'm fine. <laughs> um, and, cool. uh, well, yes, we'll, um, 
take everything else, though. All right. Okay. Good to know. And, and I put a note about the bracers in the. Uh, yes, I see that. Chapter. There was one armor. And you were saying something? Uh. Hmm. I think Cal is going to slip downstairs and attempt to open the vault out of pure curiosity. All right, go for it. Cool. You can oh. head downstairs. Sit so um, to see what's in there. <laughs> if you tell us where you're going anyways. Uh, yeah, Cal will be like... So I think one of these keys uh, to the vault downstairs. Duh. I'm mighty curious about what's down there and maybe our new friend's uh, gear and supplies might be down there. So I'm going to check it out. I'm kind of curious too. Just a little bit though. Careful, careful if you're going to take anything. Some of that might be hot. Cal motions at the armor that still clipped to their bag, and you guys have seen them rifling through Robella, Robella's pockets. It's like, I think I got enough now. <laughs> Fair enough. I just wanted to point out. All right. Appreciate it. So Cal and Soot are going down into the vault? Yeah. Alright. Easily done. Are uh, Victor and Fern staying up top then? Uh, yeah, keep an eye on these fuckers and some of them are conscious. Fair enough. Gary, still just like... Cool. Yep, cool. We're having a good time. But Cal and Victor can, uh, no, Cal and Soot, rather, can go, uh, can go down into the vault. Inside it, you find the following. Ooh. There's a large chest. Um, there are a couple chests. There's a small one and a large one. Which one do you open first? Uh, large one. Mm. Okay. Inside the large chest, you find the following. A key. A bag. 1,600 copper pieces. 640 silver pieces. 300 gold pieces. And 40 platinum pieces. 40 platinum? Yep. Oh, shit. There is also a small pouch with uh, some gemstones in it. And a set of silver chalices all bearing the symbol of Aristil. Um, and you recall that um, the temple of Aristil was where the bodies were taken at the, after the first murder and presumably after the second murder as well. Um, and that sister, Ezrael de Woodmere, was an acolyte of Aristil. Mm. Um, so it's, Hello. because you're the detect magic guy, do you detect magic? I want to detect any magic I can find, please. <laughs> All right, both the key and the bag are magical. Um, All right. And easily when you open the bag, it's a handy haversack. Hell yeah, I'm taking that, unless Cal wants it. <laughs> Cal, Cal will wave at you to take it. Cal, immediately going back on what they said, is going to uh, grab the key, the gems, and... The gold and the platinum. All of it? Uh, yeah. 
<laughs> Very little, not all of it. Make it look like somebody was embezzling or some shit. You're a dumb fuck. <laughs> no, I think so. Fine. Does Sip see you start taking all of it? Yes. He's gonna poke you in the side and just be like, keep a little bit here. It would be suspicious if it's all gone. Cal pauses and... What are the numbers again? I'm sorry. They went um, right 640 out of silver, 300 gold pieces, and 40 platinum. Um... They'll leave 10 platinum and... Um... Sorry, how much gold was it? 300, 300. gold. Uh, 50 gold. Okay. So it's gonna take, mm. like, a hundred of that silver. <laughs> okay. Easily done. Uh, Cal, Cal does plan to share this, just so everyone knows. So oh. does not share, share you the silver. <laughs> this is for the inn God rooms bless. he's gonna be paying for later. <laughs> God. Anyway. <laughs> that is what you find in the large chest. So I'm sorry for calling you a dumb fuck. I'm very sorry. <laughs> You're fine. They are I a know, dumb fuck. But I, I, I came <laughs> off very aggressive, and I'm so sorry. You're good. You're good. It was funny though. Yeah. Cal dumb fuck moment. <laughs> <laughs> that that's just what they are. Both of us actually. <laughs> we should. The dumb fucks want us here. Look, um, look. Cal, this is Cal's first time. That's true. Both of you, this is the most money you have ever seen. 40 platinum pieces? Yeah. Oh my I god. Think, yeah, so it's sweating think, at that. I think, I think Cal does, like, pause for a moment before they start, like, gathering, like, gathering their modified amounts and, like, Um, can I, so I don't know exactly how the detect ma- Can I figure out what that key does with detect magic? Like, um, because you can make, so third round strength and location of each aura. Um, if the items or creatures bearing the aura are in line of sight, you can make a knowledge arcana skill check to, deter to determine the school of magic involved in each. Um, make one check. Um, you can make. Aura. Hmm? You can make a knowledge arcana check, um, or a um. Yeah. Let me make a knowledge arcana check or a. Oh, I have a really spell. high knowledge arcana check. Well, kinda. Oh Jesus, that's eighteen plus nine. Uh <laughs> yeah, okay. So <laughs> I'm I'm just gonna give it to you. Um, this is a key of lock jamming. Oh. Um. Basically, what it's it is what it sounds like. Um. Once it's a key that you insert it into a lock and it uh, reshapes itself and merges with the lock, so it becomes impossible to unlock. Locked up. Yep. Can you ever? You can't. And you can't ever remove it. It's one-time use. It's one-time use, um, but you can remove it. There is a command word. Um, which you would be able to figure out with a spellcraft check, um, and that makes the key disintegrate um, and leaves the lock usable again. But it's hmm. a one-time use. Um, I have spellcraft. <laughs> you can you can make a spellcraft check later when I make up a command word. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's tempted to take the key also. Fuck it, he'll take the key. <laughs> Give me all the damn magical items, I could use them. <laughs> well, Cal said they were taking the key. Oh, you did! Okay, well then, so we'll just tell you oh. what it does. There you go. <laughs> so, so or, I mean, Cal will hand it over if Soot, like, wants it. 
Uh. So it doesn't necessarily care, but he, he's got an okay, like, spellcraft thing. He's got that thing marked. It's not mm. bad. I made you guys, like, a party funds handout. If you want to use that, you don't have to. Um, I just figured it would be useful. Or would you guys prefer, like, a loot channel in Discord? Uh, oh. Maybe, di yeah, I think the Discord one would be useful for when we're not playing. It yeah, Discord one, and then we can just send things in the Discord as they happen and then have, like, a, a formalized party loot for when we're actually playing. Yeah. Cool. And then need I it need all in, like, channel. one coherent place. Mm -hmm. A loot channel called Loot Channel Boys. Um... Okay, good, because otherwise I would miss that with the soot, uh, <laughs> the soot <tit> yes. channel. <laughs> soot channel boys, loot, loot <sighs> channel boys. Um... <laughs> All right, I am because it's Aya and Skylar going to the sheriff. I don't want to run that tonight, and it's getting late. Mm -hmm. However, you guys mm -hmm. are going to level up. Nice. So, yeah. We can gloss getting the sheriff because hmm? uh, we, we can gloss over collecting the sheriff because we've just basically got to say, hey, we found. The people who have been doing the kidnapping and evidence that they that they were yeah. planning to find the and we, gonna, we found the person who we're gonna skim through um, the sheriff stuff next week. It is getting late, um, so I'm and I'm tired, so I'm done running an actual session. But good job, guys. Um, woo! You're gonna level up. Hey, you can, I can help you, you level up. You win. We you won being. We won Pathfinder. Rebella can do two d six plus four if she had hit you even a Dina. single time. <laughs> even a single Fuck. time. Two d six plus four. She could have knocked you, you out. I could have hit. I could have one shot you fuckers. You could have totally yeah, killed Soot. <laughs> Jesus. Dude, uh, she was you could not have one shot Fern, but you would have come real close. God. I would have been fine. <laughs> oh How many God. hit points does Cal have? Yeah, I mean, Cal has Cal only has fifteen. They, it, yeah. it, it would have come she close. Could. She could with max damage. She could. Two d six plus four. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But no. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Okay. It's level fine. two. Let's You're gonna be level two. Point. You are level two. You can start leveling up. Anytime you want, because you're not going to hit combat again before you sleep. Um, unless Do you have we roll um, hit dice? Or... You can roll... Yeah, let's roll. Or if, if you get ones, you don't have to take ones. You can re-roll ones. You can, you, can, you can roll or take average, but pick. Um, and if you roll one, you don't keep the one. Okay, I'm gonna- I'm gonna stop recording now.